Hey guys, Nate here with Nate's Interactive Auto. Today we have Lucas Deep Clean, a real fuel system cleaner. It states that it removes valve gunk, carbon deposits. Will this help your GDI or direct injection engine? So, we're going to find out. It treats up to 30 gallons. For directions for a deep clean, pour the entire bottle into the fuel tank and fill with any grade of gasoline. So I have something really, really exciting to show you guys. Can't wait for you to see. So let's go ahead, dive right into the test. We're facing off against a 30 year old engine. So this definitely has the job in store for it. Well guys, let's go ahead and add this to the fuel. Now that we have our Lucas added, let's go ahead and put our fuel cap back on. So we're going to go ahead, use this bore scope, and we're going to show you guys what these valves look like with all this carbon buildup. You're definitely going to see a challenge for this Lucas. Okay guys, here's valve number one. And does it look bad? Oh yeah, it's really bad. I'm not sure anything will help this valve. Let's move on to valve number two. Wow guys, this valve's just as bad. Look at all this carbon buildup. I'm not sure if anything's gonna help it. Let's move on to three. And here is valve number three. Definitely work cut out for it. Let's move on to valve number four. Wow, look at this, number four is terrible. Oh no, I don't really know. <laughs> this is really quite a challenge for any chemical to clean this. Well guys, before we jump in and show you guys these after shots let me know what do you think do you think this stuff actually worked or was it even possible for anything to take on these intake valves honestly it's almost impossible for any cleaner to match up with this so we'll go ahead jump right in get hooked back up with our borescope camera and find out did this stuff actually work so just drop that comment below and let me know what you think or any experience you've had or something that you want to see tested. Well guys, we've got her started up and now we're going to take her for a drive. We're going to show you just a little bit of this drive. Well, we got a few thousand miles to go, so let's hit up about 3,000 miles. So guys, are we getting any exhaust smoke? I don't really see any quite yet, but hey, we took her for a 3,000 mile journey. Here we are back with our time lapse in play. Now, let's go ahead and move right along. Well guys, you wanna definitely drive it around for a few thousand miles, bring it up to operating temperature, rev the engine up to 3,500 RPMs a few times, an Italian tune-up essentially and then you want to check out your intake valves well guys here's valve number one look what do you think about this one okay guys valve number two this one's definitely looking pretty good too I can see some carbon reduction let's move on to valve number three well what do you think about this valve carbon reduction or not you let me know you decide so i love to hear your guys opinion here we have valve number four it definitely looks bad what do you think can you notice any carbon reduction well guys that was a tough battle for any product to have to perform make sure you subscribe to the channel and let me know what you guys want to see because this is what nate's interactive auto is all about this is a community where we work together so 
you have any ideas, be sure and let me know. Thank you for watching.